Hey there! Today I want to present you a new oil painting on canvas that I started painting some time ago and uh, I just finished painting. This painting represents an uh, artistic study of the human anatomy which uh, let's call it the thinker. Many of you have asked me in private what you need to do to make the character you paint look as realistic as you think. By nature, your audience has a basic understanding of how the human body is supposed to look and move. That means if something isn't right about your character. For instance, their proportions aren't correct or joints don't bend the right way. That character will lose believability. And this applies even if you're drawing cartoon characters who aren't meant uh, to look realistic. If something is fundamentally of about how your character looks or moves, your audience will notice. Understanding the basic human anatomy and how to paint it will give you characters life and believability and set up your story or illustration for success. Perhaps the artist most well known for anatomical drawings is Leonardo da Vinci. Da Vinci created over 240 detailed drawings of the human body based on the dissections of human uh, corpses in a hospital in Florence, Milan, and, uh, and Rome. The drawings include detailed uh, depictions of the human skeleton and its uh, muscles and uh, sinus. Ultimately, uh, uh, da Vinci developed a masterful understanding of how the human body moves. A great contribution to both art and science. While your goal may not be to create anatomically uh, correct uh, drawing for scientific purpose, an understanding of the human body can equip you to draw more realistic and uh, believable characters. You can simplify the process of drawing human anatomy into three uh, general uh, uh, steps. Blocking, shaping, and defining. So, blocking means using basic shapes to create the general uh, silhouette of the figure. Uh, shaping means building the muscle structure and anatomy on top of those uh, shapes. And uh, defining means adding in the uh, appropriate level of uh, detail depending on the style of your uh, illustration. So, now, let me show you some stages during the work and after. If you have any questions, please leave them in the uh, comment section.
Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.